So that's a fix that they could make today if they chose. How are we going to communicate this to LinkedIn? Well, that's a great question. And I don't have an easy answer for that. Um, you know, I think it takes having a having some leverage and a movement behind it first um, before, you know, we approach. I mean, you can always suggest and say, hey, what, what are you doing about this? I don't think there's anything wrong with that. This is what we'd like to see. This is our concern. Um, you know, can you create a spam filter for, for DMs, um, for anything that's scammy, overly salesy, and clearly inappropriate or hateful? Yeah. Um, secondly, can there be uh, an approval? Because like, if you go to like, a, if you start a Facebook group, for example, um, you can set the, the group in such a way that people can't just post or comment without your approval. And, and so you're approving. So that, you know, not everybody wants to do that because then you're, you know, you're spending a lot of time checking and reading and so forth. But if it's on yeah. your own content, you'd still get a chance to know, is it, you know, is it good, bad or indifferent? Um, you know, in that case, are you just, you know, I think people would censor out any, any divergent opinion on their post, even if it was respectful. So there's kind of a, a question mark for me there. If that's the best thing in the world from a open what, communication standpoint. What was your insight, Inga? Um, that's also valid on LinkedIn groups as well. Um, oh, is it you the same? Can, I, yeah, I've, I've, I have a LinkedIn group that I've, um, that I administer and I actually need to approve uh, both on there. And I was also going to say, if they can bring a laughing emoji to uh, LinkedIn, then come on, they can do this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Nice. No, I think just, you know, pe we just need to make enough noise about it, I think. Yeah. Because from my understanding, a lot of people wanted to be able to like a comment with a laugh instead of just liking it. Mm -hmm. um, and that came and everybody was so happy that, you know, laughing is allowed on LinkedIn. Do you like, know what I'll do then? What I'll do is I'll see if there's a, a, or yeah, I won't do it in the middle of the call. I'll see after the call if there is a news story about how many people uh, had to do that to get that to happen. Yeah. Because that would then set a bar uh, of which we need to reach, which will then focus our efforts moving forward. So we know that when you mess up, in their opinion, they make you go through these various hoops. So the fact that process is in place, that's mm. all, we haven't got to reinvent the wheel. We mm. know that abusive and inappropriate content is coming through DMs and a filtering system is easy. If you want to, because a friend of mine who's, I mean, look, I'm wearing an Iron Maid t-shirt and a spiky collar. The friends I've got are, shall we say, salty um in their uh, in their use of language and he said to me oh i don't want to stop this and the other it's free speech i want my friend to be able to send me you know goat porn or some stupid thing like that and you know he's just being a, he's being a he's older than me he's just he's just being an old bloke basically um because it's not freedom of speech when it's abusive or oppressive or selling so the technology requiring your verification be a manual process or an automated process exists already. Mm. We're looking only to uh, affect comments on the posts and DMs. So it's a narrowing uh, funnel of focus. And what we're basically saying is that a filter system which the user can choose so that if someone wants to get abusive because i mean some people i mean twitter is based on the people abusing each other that that's what it's there for <laughs> yeah I, don't, I know i don't i don't it's play like with it. it yeah um so but on linkedin it's not about abusing each other's positions it's about making professional connections mm -hmm. so that is in the bag so if right okay right i've got a plan so uh gregory say something while i take a note of this or before i forget it yeah, yeah. So, and I, I've been taking some notes in the background as well. Um, so to, to understand, 
what was that barrier to entry? Uh, how many people did it take uh, to say, can we get that laughing emoji before they kind of said, okay, we're going to put this into our uh, update plan and get that into the system. 